In the last few months, we have all been rightfully concerned with the workload doctors and medical staff are faced with. Some of us have also wondered whether that extra visit to the doctor will benefit or put us under more risk. Monica has a PhD in immunology and Diraj is a machine learning specialist. Their company, Zelf, is here to empower both doctors and patients. Over to you, Monica. Do you know that in India, there is only one expert doctor for every 5,000 seriously ill patients. This global pandemic has further strained this healthcare system. Imagine the impact. Meet Dr. Pawan. He works at one of the public hospitals in India that's also our first paying customer. He is already four times overburdened with patients and the limited time he gets with the patients, majority of that goes into trivial tasks like collecting and analyzing patients' data. This, on the other hand, often makes patients feel isolated and disconnected. They feel that the information they get on their disease management with the on the, in the limited time with the clinician is not enough. Well, they are not alone. It's a widely common gap due to skewed ratio. But what if we could actually use technology to empower both doctors as well as the patients? That's exactly what Zelthi does. Introducing India's first personalized digital health intervention platform that can easily be integrated with hospital's electronic health record system. Once the patient has met the doctor, patients get invited onto Zelf platform. As the patient leaves the hospital, they stay securely connected with the care team. Zelf automatically interviews patients with adaptive questionnaire and all the data is analyzed by Zelf's algorithm powered by machine learning. Patients receive personalized feedback, including useful information and instructions for mild symptoms. Data get transferred to care team in real time. They have access to comprehensive dashboard. As soon as something is alarming, care team is alerted immediately. It not only saves time, also leads to high patient satisfaction and reduced call burdens. We are very happy to have paid pilots with two of the biggest public hospitals in India. In the next few months, we would be catering to more than 30,000 patients. Not just that, we have five more hospitals in the pipeline from India, Singapore, Malaysia, as well as Nepal. If you're wondering why these hospitals are interested in working with us, the reason is we are uniquely positioned in this region with a focus on patient reported outcomes. There are similar companies, majorly in the West, and some of them use sensors to collect vitals data and do predictive analysis for heart and kidney disorders. Good news is, Few similar companies have recently raised large amount of money indicating it's a growing investment opportunity. Further, the recent changes in regulations to promote telehealth in India due to COVID gives us the best time to pioneer digital healthcare in this region. We are majorly a B2B2C company with a subscription model to hospitals. And once the platform is robust enough with good amount of data, we would be licensing it to pharma companies to help with clinical trials and drug discovery. We have a perfect team to win in this space. Dhiraj Mundra, CTO, he has more than six years of experience building AI-powered softwares, particularly for healthcare that has catered to more than 10 million users. I, with a PhD in immunology, have seven years of experience in the field. I have worked with SingHealth and Roche Group, leading multiple clinical trials and drug discovery projects. We have Dr. A.K. Vaid as our medical advisor. He is a world-renowned doctor with more than 30 years of experience. He has also been awarded with Padma Shri, that's the highest civilian award given by Government of India. We are looking to raise $1 million in investment reaching 20 hospitals, catering to 500,000 patients and generating 3 million in revenue. We are very happy that with the MVP itself, we are able to see the impact. We are not only reducing burdens for doctors, but also putting patients back in control. So, what are you waiting for? If you are an investor or strategic partner, join us now to build the future of value-based healthcare together.